Good afternoon, all of you. Good afternoon, sir. Okay, let's start with the yesterday's session. Uh, some of the points we have discussed, and uh, today we'll discuss about the business economics and some related points in the engineering economic decisions. Still, we are discussing the introductory part. still we have to start with our main point that is the engineering economic decisions yesterday we have discussed the basic concept of what we mean by the economics engineering types of the economics <coughs> okay because these are the terms which we are requiring uh, in order to study the subsequent part of this unit so lastly yesterday we have discussed the two types of the economics what are the two types of the economics micro economics yes. and macro and macro economics micro economics and the macro economics macro what what is the difference what do you mean by the micro economics yes what do you mean by the micro economics and the macro economics micro economics means uh, which uh, single person uh, household or the hmm. business organization hmm 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 means micro economics micro economics means uh, overall country oh yes means micro economics in the sense the economics related with the your whole individual home house or the single business and the uh, when you think about the <clears throat> overall economy economy of the certain country region or the economy of the whole world then that things comes under the macro economics and also uh, i have given you the example when when uh, some economist uh, think about the economy of the particular country then that thing comes under the category of the macro economics so also we have discussed which are the things comes under the uh, macro economics like the foreign trade uh then the um, uh, government monetary policy uh then also we have discussed the inflation un unemployment rate <clears throat> interest rate these all the things comes under the point of the macro economics and also we have discussed about the what do you mean by the monetary policy monetary policy is what <clears throat> what is the monetary policy money management money manage arthik niyojan money management for the whole country now in that i already told you uh, the money that uh, monetary policy is decided by whom who decide the monetary Boss. policy for india arth mantri which bank is there uh, which is our central bank rbi okay reserve RBI. bank of india mm -hmm. and the governor of the reserve bank of india and that whole team decide the monetary policy ki manje monetary policy decide karta manje kay karta ki market madhe kiti paisa supply kela gela pahije how much money should be supply in the market and yesterday i told you the one homework that you should search on that ki why we should not uh, how much money we can print and uh, if uh, unlimited money we can print then why government not printing unlimited amount of money that question i yesterday told you to do the homework on that does anybody uh, have done that why we can't print the unlimited amount of money yes in order to print the money do we have to take the permission just of the money print kela 
कॉस्ट पण इन्क्रीज होते म्हणजे एक कंट्री झिम्बाम्बे त्यात त्या गव्हर्नमेंटने व्हेरी गुड व्हेरी गुड म्हणजे सगळ्यांना व्हॉट इज युअर नेम तनपुरी अश्विनी व्हेरी गुड तनपुरी अश्विनी यू हॅव डन द सर्चिंग बिकॉज हां यस कॅरी ऑन कॅरी ऑन ही झिम्बाम्बे ती कंट्री त्यात त्या गव्हर्नमेंटने ना म्हणजे सगळे गरीब आहे ते सगळे श्रीमंत करायचं ते केलं होतं त्यांनी सगळ्यांना ते केलं पण एक ब्रेड चा पॅकेट घेण्यासाठी त्यांना मिलियन पर्यंत पोते वरून पैसे एक किलो गहू घेण्यासाठी तुम्हाला पोते वरून पैसे कारण ते तांदूळ हा तर पैसे जर तुम्ही अनलिमिटेड केले तर त्याच्या माग सिंपल लॉजिक आहे आता एक गोष्ट लक्षात घ्या तुम्ही की आपल्या देशामध्ये पैसे जर प्रिंट करायचे असतील तर आपल्याला कुठल्याही देशाची परवानगी लागत नाही That is the complete right of our country <laughs> to, print, <laughs> to print how much money you want to print. Okay. But think about, if we have a lot of money to print our country, and we have to work with all of them, what do we do? Do we work with the same thing? 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 No. If we work with the same thing, then we work with the same thing. If we work with the same thing, then we work with the same thing. जर शेतकऱ्यांना पैसे वाटले तर शेतकरी कशाला काम करते सिंपल आहे ना करेक्ट yes, आणि मग कुणीच काम केलं नाही तर अन्नधान्याचं प्रोडक्शन होईल का बिझनेस मध्ये बिझनेस सगळ्यांनाच पैसे वाटले तर कुणी बिझनेस मध्ये काम करेल का बिझनेसेस येतील का yes, काहीच होणार नाही ना ठप्प होईल ना अर्थव्यवस्था करेक्ट और नॉट आणि मग पैसे आपल्याकडे एवढे असे पैसे असून उपयोग होईल का त्या पैशांनी जर जर गुड्स अँड सर्व्हिसेस जर अवेलेबल नसतील बरोबर ना तुम्हाला कोण हॉटेल मध्ये सर्व्हिस देईल का कारण हॉटेलवाल्याकडे सुद्धा पैसे असणार आहेत ना तो कशाला हॉटेल चालवेल राईट और रॉंग दॅट इज द रिझन गव्हर्नमेंट हॅज टू प्रिंट द मनी अकॉर्डिंग टू द व्हॅल्यू ऑफ गुड्स अँड सर्व्हिसेस प्रेझेंट इन दॅट कंट्री मी तुम्हाला सांगितलं जी डी पी ग्रॉस डोमेस्टिक प्रोडक्ट की आपल्या देशामधले जे काही गुड्स अँड सर्व्हिसेस अवेलेबल आहेत तर त्या गुड्स आणि सर्व्हिसेसची टोटल व्हॅल्यू किती आहे तर त्याच्यानुसार आपल्या देशामध्ये काय होत असत सगळ्याच देशामध्ये मनी प्रिंटिंग केलं जात यू आर गेटिंग द पॉइंट ओके सो दॅट इज अ सिंपल लॉजिक and these things these things is decided by whom these things are decided by the central bank of india that is our rbi reserve bank of india and they decide how much amount of money needs to be get printed tar mag asa kadhi tari situation ete ki paise aplyala jasta print karav lagta for example ata apan corona period chalu aahe pan ata government ne ek pati magta 2 3 mahina purvi 20 lakh crore cha package dilo hota all of you must be knowing this तर अशा काहीतरी सिच्युएशन आली तर आपण जास्त पैसे प्रिंट करू शकतो पण नेहमीच असे जास्त पैसे प्रिंट करणं हे आपल्या पर्टिक्युलर कंट्रीच्या इकॉनॉमी साठी दिस इज नॉट द गुड थिंग अंडरस्टू सो बेस्ड ऑन दिस डिफरंट फॅक्टर मनी प्रिंटिंग इज कॅरिड ऑन अँड दॅट ऑल दिस ऑल दिस थिंग्स गेट डिसायडेड अंडर द मॉनिटरी पॉलिसी अँड दिस ऑल द थिंग्स देन कम्स अंडर द विच काइंड ऑफ इकॉनॉमी मॅक्रो इकॉनॉमी ओके नाव today we are going to discuss one more important type uh, point that is the business economics now can you tell me just like we have discussed in the, our home number of economic activities are happening in our home number of economic activities are happening or not yes sir when our parents earn the money that is also an economic activity when they spend the money for different goods and services that is also the economic activity when they save the money that is also economic activity when they pay the pay your fees that is also the economic activity so this different kind of economic economic activities are happening in our home also so my question is what also does so in the businesses also this kind of economic activities are happening yes sir yes and so to carry on to conduct this kind of business activities uh, economic activities in the business 
देर इज अ नॉलेज देर इज अ रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ नॉलेज ऑफ पर्टिक्युलर बिजनेस इकोनॉमिक्स आता यस्टर्डे ऑल्सो आय टोल्ड यू आपल्या घरामध्ये कोणी असं इकॉनॉमिक्स ची डिग्री घेतलेलं असतं का की त्याच्यानुसार ते काम करतात असं नाही आपल्या घरामध्ये कोण असतं का इकॉनॉमिक्स ची डिग्री असलेलं एखाद्याच्या घरामध्ये असू शकेल नाही ना पण मग आता बिझनेस मध्ये असं असं चालेल का सांगा मला बिझनेस मध्ये इकॉनॉमिक ची डिग्री असलेलेच व्यक्ती लागेल बरोबर ना बिझनेसेस मध्ये वेगवेगळे आपण म्हणतो की सपोज तुम्ही इफ यू टेक द एक्झाम्पल ऑफ सॉफ्टवेअर इंडस्ट्री नाव इन द सॉफ्टवेअर इंडस्ट्री डिफरंट पीपल्स आर वर्किंग लाईक इन द एच आर डिपार्टमेंट डिफरंट पीपल्स वर्किंग इन द कोडिंग डिपार्टमेंट डिफरंट पीपल्स वर्किंग टेस्टिंग डिपार्टमेंट डिफरंट पीपल्स वर्किंग फायनान्स डिपार्टमेंट डिफरंट पीपल्स वर्किंग नाव इन द एच आर डिपार्टमेंट विच डिग्री इज रिक्वायरमेंट इफ यू थिंक अबाउट द एच आर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ एनी कंपनी विच डिग्री इज रिक्वायर्ड ह्युमन रिसोर्स डिपार्टमेंट यू मस्ट हर्ड अबाउट द एम बी एस सर सो इन द ह्युमन रिसोर्स डिपार्टमेंट देर इज अ रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ द पर्सन हु हॅज द डिग्री फ्रॉम द एम बी ए सो इन केस ऑफ द बिझनेसेस दे ऑल्सो नीड द सम स्पेशलिस्ट पर्सन हु हॅव द डीप नॉलेज ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स अँड दॅट दॅट इज द रिझन आय एम सेईंग इन द इन द बिझनेसेस ऑर इन द इंडस्ट्री they are also having some people who are having the deep knowledge of the economics who have the degree of the economics and you know to conduct the various economic activities within a business so that's from that we can say the business firm or the company is also the uh, consist of the various kind of economic activity because in the businesses also different activities are get conducted which activities like the production activity happens consumption act when they supply product to the consumer to the customer consumption activity happens distribution activity happens exchange activity happens understood so this same kind of activities are also happening in the business but their uh, their uh, way of performing these activities different so in the production means what companies or the business used to produce the different kind of products okay now you know to produce the product they have to utilize the different raw materials they have to utilize the different resources like human okay money land this kind of resources they require or they consume they also distribute this product to the consumers from that they get the money understood so this is all the things are there in the businesses also that's why you can say the businesses also consist of the various kind of economic activity okay and that is the reason we can say an economic activity in the businesses or in the home or in the any sector is nothing but adjusting the means to the ends now this term is uh, quite related with the economic activity in the businesses that is what adjusting means to the ends or you can also relate this term that is adjusting means to the ends in case of our home economic activities also what do you mean by the adjust adjusting means to the ends here i have written economic activity involves adjusting means to the ends here means is nothing but available goods services and the resources and ends is nothing but what now if you think about the uh, business or the any industry in case of them the means are nothing but the different resources available and end is nothing but what kind of product that can be produced with the help of the this kind of resources and that is the reason what is being written an economic activity involves adjusting means to the ends what what i told you regarding the means 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 what here meaning of the means is what available resources now in the businesses or in the industry what kind of resources are there yes in the industry what kind of resources are there what kind of resources are there in the businesses or industries people money 
हा दीज आर दीपल मनी रॉ मटेरियल एटसेट्रा एटसेट्रा मग हा गोषी कंपन मध्य अनलिमिटेड का गोष्टी का युटिशन कस के प्रोड्यूस सम प्रोडक्ट बट प्रोडक्ट जे प्रोडक्ट जे प्रोड्यूस कराए अनलिमिटेड यस और नो प्रोडक्ट जे प्रोड्यूस कराएट कैन बी द अनलिमिटेड मीन्स दैट इज आई एम ट्राइंग टू से हियर यू हेव टू युटिलाइज द लिमिटेड रिसोर्सेस to complete the unlimited kind of products and that is that is the reason this is called as the economic activity and that is the meaning of this adjusting means to the ends means doing the adjustment of your resources to produce the different kind of products so this that is the reason this is also referred as one kind of activity okay the uh, economic activity okay utilizing your limited amount of resources to generate the some unlimited kind of products or to generate some uh, limited kind of products is nothing but also referred as a economic activity now business when you say the business now it, it it is nothing but the transforming some kind of input into the output it utilize the different kind of raw material and it is it produce some end product as a output okay so generally business is considered as a value added process what do you mean by the value added process why the businesses can be considered as a value added process yes what do you mean by value added process now businesses does what businesses take some input in the form of the raw material design etc etc and they they convert into the some output in the sense they they uh, they produce some product yes or no that is the thing happening in the different businesses correct or not Yes. yes. Now tell me whether the whether the costing uh, the whether the cost required for this input and the cost required for this output or the cost of this output product or cost of these uh, things required to uh, produce this product will be the will be the same or different? Different. Different, na. Different. Input ch cost kami as. Uh, definitely the cost of the input will be less as as compared with the cost of the output barobar na product ja ja price madhe tumhi company product produce karte tyas price madhe company product vikel ka sanga mala no nahi ta tase jala tar ti company kashi jalnar means what that is that is referred as what value added process means the value of output is in excess of the value of input काय की इनपुट पर्टिक्युलर प्रोडक्ट ऐसी इनपुट ऐसी जी वैल्यू है दैट इनपुट वैल्यू इज लेस दैन द आउटपुट वैल्यू इन द सेंस द फाइनली जनरेटर प्रोडक्ट इज हैविंग द मोर वैल्यू एज कंपेयर विद द वैल्यू ऑफ द इनपुट फॉर दैट पर्टिक्युलर प्रोडक्ट एंड दैट इज द रीजन बिजनेस कैन ऑल्सो बी रिफर्ड एज द वैल्यू एडेड प्रोसेस ओके नाउ डिफरेंट बिजनेसेस हैविंग देयर मेन गोल द मेन गोल इज नथिंग बट द मैक्सिमाइजिंग इट्स प्रॉफिट okay that is the main goal of different kind of businesses what maximizing their profit by utilizing the whatever the resources are available there whatever the limited resources are available there utilizing that main goal of the different businesses is what to maximize the profit to generate the maximum number of products using that limited number of resources okay and so See here, I have mentioned decision made in the businesses also considered as, and that is the reason various kind of decision made in the businesses is also considered as a economic process because resources are limited and ends to achieve may be the unlimited. मतलब क्या है कि product product produce करने साथी तुम चकर जी क्या resources आते हैं human resource, money resource, machinery resource, material resource है क्या limited resources are there and using this limited resource you have to generate some products here meaning of the end you have to take what products using that resources you have to generate the product and that product generation uh, product generation can be the unlimited understood there might be you might be having the unlimited orders related to the generation of product but you may not have that amount of resources available understood 
so doing this adjustment doing this adjustment is nothing but the called as the economic process aplya gharamadhe sudha same thing can be happen in our home also ki aplya gharaja unlimited asu shakta but you know to complete that all the needs of ours we 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 might not have the all the resources available we might not have the money available understood so when we are doing this kind of adjustment in your home or in the businesses also then that is called as the economic process understood the meaning of the economic process yes sir okay now now what exactly then mean by the business economics how we can define the business economic term so here i have defined the business economics term we can define the business economics as the application of economic theory principle and methodology to decision making problems faced by the business firms in simple words we can say business economics is nothing but when when the particular businesses take the help of economics when the different businesses take the help of the economics to make the various kind of decision in the business then that is called as the business economics am i right yes or no yes sir now in the businesses main thing is what taking the decision at the different levels correct now what kind of decision is being taken in the businesses can you tell me based on our previous discussions what kind of decisions are now in the businesses various decision being taken can you tell me the some example manche sir ekada project getla tar tar bolu ekada project planning, select karaycha planning त्या प्रोजेक्ट त्या प्लॅनिंग म्हणजे तुम्हाला एखादी प्रोडक्ट एखादा प्रोडक्ट प्रोड्यूस करायचा आहे ऍज अ ऍज अ पार्ट ऑफ युअर प्रोजेक्ट बरोबर मग त्या प्रोजेक्टची कॉस्ट किती असायला पाहिजे त्या प्रोजेक्टची इनपुट कॉस्ट किती असेल त्या प्रोजेक्ट कंप्लीट करण्यासाठी तुम्हाला किती मॅन पॉवर लागेल त्यासाठी किती खर्च येईल तो फायनल प्रोडक्ट जेन प्रोड्यूस झाल्यानंतर तो तुम्ही किती प्राइस मध्ये विकणार आहे तो प्रोडक्ट प्रोड्यूस करण्यासाठी तुमच्याकडे तुमच्याकडे जी सफिशियंट मनी असायला पाहिजे ते तुमच्या तुमच्या कंपनीकडे आहेत की नाही नसतील तर काय करावे लागेल ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टींसाठी ज्या वेळेस इकॉनॉमिकची हेल्प घेतली जाते वेन इन ऑर टू टेक ऑल दिस काइंड ऑफ डिसिजन वेन द हेल्प ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स इज बिंग टेकन देन दॅट इज कॉल्ड एज द बिझनेस इकॉनॉमिक्स वॉट द पॉइंट मग आता मला सांगा एखाद्या कंपनीकडे एखादा प्रोडक्ट त्यांना प्रोड्यूस करायचा आहे एखादा प्रोजेक्ट त्यांना कम्प्लीट करायचा आहे पण त्या कंपनीकडे पैसे नसतील असं होऊ शकतं की नाही होऊ शकत मग ती कंपनी काय करेल लोन साठी लोन आता जवळपास जेवढ्या काही बिझनेसेस आहेत सिक्स्टी पर्सेंट बिझनेसेस आर हॅव्हिंग देअर लोन नाव कंपनीज फ्रॉम अवर कंट्री कॅन कॅन टेक द लोन फ्रॉम द डिफरंट बँक फ्रॉम डिफरंट फायनान्स दे कॅन ऑल्सो टेक द लोन फ्रॉम द आउटसाइड फ्रॉम द सोर्सेस विच आर आउटसाइड अवर कंट्रीज ऑल्सो अंडरस्टूड सो नाव हे मग हे सगळ्या गोष्टी करण्यासाठी की कुठल्या बँकेकडून लोन घ्यायचं किती लोन घ्यायचं त्याच्यावर इंटरेस्ट रेट आपल्याला कुठला इंटरेस्ट रेट आपल्या कंपनीला परवडण्यासारखा आहे ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टी डिसाईड करण्यासाठी इकॉनॉमिक्सची हेल्प लागेल की नाही सांगा मला लागेल सर अँड दॅट वेन वी टे वेन टेकिंग धीस काइंड ऑफ डिसिजन वी टेक द हेल्प ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स अँड दॅट इज रिफर्ड ऍज द बिझनेस इकॉनॉमिक्स विच इज बिंग रिटर्न हिअर इन द technical words we can define the business economic as the application of economic theory principle and methodology to decision making problems faced by the business firm understood yes sir so some some kind of decision like setting the setting the targets setting the targets manje kay ki tumcha product kiti kiti kalavadi madhe kiwa kit konta ek varsha madhe purna jala pahije ki 6 varsha 6 mahine madhe purna jala pahije जर तो पर्टिक्युलर टाइम मध्ये पूर्ण झाला तर कंपनीला किती फायदा होईल किती प्रॉफिट होईल जर तो पर्टिक्युलर टाइम मध्ये तुमचं टार्गेट पूर्ण झालेलं झालं नाही तर कंपनीला त्याचा लॉस होऊ शकतो का नाही ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टीचा डिसिजन घेण्यासाठी वेन देर इज अ युटिलायझेशन ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स देन दॅट इज कॉल्ड ऍज द बिझनेस इकॉनॉमिक्स सो इन द प्रिन्सिपल्स अँड द मेथडॉलॉजी मेथडॉलॉजी ऑफ द इकॉनॉमिक्स थिरी इनेबल द बिझनेसेस फॉर्म टू अलोकेट द रिसोर्सेस 
मोस्ट इफिशियंटली जर तुम्हारा पर्टिक्युलर टाइम मध्य प्रोजेक्ट कम्प्लीट कर यूजिंग दैट यू हैव टू अर्न द प्रॉफिट मोर प्रॉफिट बाय लॉन्चिंग दैट प्रोडक्ट इन द मार्केट मग कुछले रिसोर्सेस अलोकेट के लिए गले प्रमाण रिसोर्सेस अलोकेट के लिए पाजे रिसोर्सेस मध्य सग आल एवरीथिंग कम्स इन द रिसोर्स लाइक मनी मैन पॉवर मटेरियल मशीनरी नाउ यू नॉट टू टेक द डिशीजन रिनेटेड विद अलोकेटिंग रिसोर्सेस ऑल्सो देर इज वी कैन बिजनेसेस ऑल्सो टेक द हेल्प ऑफ द इकोनॉमिक्स and when the businesses take the help of the economics to do all these kind of things that is called as the business economics got the point yes sir yes sir the same thing below i have mentioned the business economics is the application of knowledge of the economic concept ki economics related je kai knowledge je ata he knowledge kunala asu shakel aplyala ek knowledge sang डीप नॉलेज अपने बिजनेस कंपनी मध्य जाऊन इकोनॉमिक्स हो स्पेसिफिक डिग्री डिग्री फ्रॉम द कॉमर्स दैट काइंड ऑफ पीपल गेट हायर इन दीज बिजनेस एंड बिकॉज एंड दे आर है ऑल द नॉलेज ऑफ दीज इकोनॉमिक कन्सेप्ट सो बिजनेस इकोनॉमिक्स इज द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ नॉलेज ऑफ इकोनॉमिक कन्सेप्ट मेथड्स एंड द टूल्स ऑफ एनालिस टू द बिजनेस डिशीजन मेकिंग प्रोसेस within the firm or organization in conducting the business activity you know to conduct the various kind of business activity when there is a when the help of the economics is being taken when the help of the concept of the economics when the help of the methods of the economics when the help of the tools of the economics is being taken then that is called as the business economics i hope now the concept is clear shall we move forward yes sir okay so uh, same thing uh, in the another more detail i have mentioned the business economist business economist ki tya business madhe jo koni arthashastra tumhi nivadlela ahe tyachi tumhi nemnuk kelela ahe the economist which you have chosen which you have hire for your business now it is the duty of that economist to advise the businessmen or management of company on financial matters such as the financial needs alternative arrangement of the business finance etc etc tumhi ekada educational institute jari getle tar te educational institute madhe ca asto baka ca yes i hope all of you are having no uh, all of you know about the ca yes What is the long form of the CA? Yes, Kai CA means who? Kai Kai Kam Pesar. Chart account. Chart and account. Kai. Chart and account. Kai. Chart and account. Accounting the Kam. Taxes. Kiti. Taxes. Arrangements the Kam. Okay. Ja Kai financial gusti asti Pesar related. He is having the knowledge. So, so that kind of person or uh, that kind of person who are having the deep knowledge of the economic concept, we are referring it as an economist and. it is the duty of that economist to advise the businessman management of financial matters such as the financial need alternative arrangement of the business etc etc just a particular company che vakil astat baka vakil yes company che vakil yes, astat baka tyancha kaam kay asta what is the role of uh, yes advocate's role ka asto legal advices dena legal advices dena very good tar itha ka economy cha role kay ki financial related advices tya company la dene and when the businesses take the help of this financial advantage uh, You take the help of these financial uh, suggestions and the ad uh, advices from that economics, then that is referred as the business economics. So the these economists are responsible for guiding the business in ensuring that the business operation must happen in smoother way and business operation must give the particular profit 
business operation must bring a fair return on the capital used company ni jevda paisa ekadya product produce karnasathi kharcha kela asel tar tya company la tyanni je investment kelela ahe tar tyacha peksha jasta tyanna fayda jala pahije tar ya sagya goshti madhe advise karnyacha kaam kon karta economist and when businesses take the help of such kind of economist that is called as the business economist so this is the very important topic four marks four marks notes can be asked on the this particular topic that is the business uh, economics okay now when the businesses are being running then that businesses also has to face different kind of or different level of problems or businesses has to face different level of issues and hence here we have the four different levels of economic analysis okay related with the businesses we have the four levels of economic analysis that a business might need to consider so there are the four main economic analysis related with different kind of problems or the issue that may be faced by the businesses related with the economics okay and here we are going to discuss these different four levels of economic analysis okay which related with which businesses might have might have to face the problems and now which are that four levels of economic analysis which are that four levels on which the economic analysis has to be done okay which are that four levels at which the economic analysis has to be done or which are the different four levels in the businesses at which the businesses businesses might face some problems or businesses might face issues okay so out of that four levels we have the first level that is the at the firm level economic analysis at the firm level firm means what business company business company तर फक्त बिजनेस त्या बिजनेस कंपनी जस्ट रिलेटेड विथ दॅट बिजनेस कंपनी और जस्ट रिलेटेड विथ दॅट बिजनेस फर्म व्हॉट काइंड ऑफ इकॉनॉमिक अनालिसिस और व्हॉट काइंड ऑफ इकॉनॉमिक इश्यूज दॅट बिजनेस माइट हॅव टू बी फेस सो जस्ट रिलेटेड विथ द फर्म ओनली हियर आय हॅव मेंशन इकॉनॉमिक इश्यूज फेसिंग द बिजनेसेस ऍट दिस लेव्हल ऑफ अनालिसिस व्हिच लेव्हल ऍट द लेव्हल ऑफ फर्म कॅन बी is primarily concerned with the problems of the production problems of the price setting problems of the costing problems of the revenue etc etc tar firm level la ki fakt tancha business cha maryadit okay just related with their business what kind of economic issue they have to consider what kind of economic issue they have to consider problem related with the production means what प्रोडक्शन 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 प्रोडक्ट so these are the problems related with related with which the economic analysis has to be done so this is the first level out of the four level at which the economic analysis has to be done related with the various kind of issues which are available at the firm level understood the first level yes sir second level second level at which also the economic analysis has to be done related with the various problems that might come second level is nothing but the market and the industry which is the second level market and the industry so economic issue facing the business at this level of analysis tend to focused on implication implication or implic implication of the market structure for business performance number and size of the firms limitation of the market expansion etc etc the second level ji that is what market and the 
industry now at this level what kind of economic issue may be faced by the particular business now what kind of economic mm -hmm. issue may be faced now one important issue at this level of market and industry is implication of the market structure for mm -hmm. business performance mm -hmm. what do you mean by this implication of the market structure for business performance what is the meaning of this implication of the market in structure for business performance what do you mean by this implication implication of the market structure for the business performance म्हणजे आपल्या बिझनेस आपण कस डेव्हलपमेंट केले पाहिजे त्याचे एक्झॅक्टली प्रॉपर लॉस्टचं सगळं स्ट्रक्चर कसं पाहिजे इट्स अ मॅनेजमेंट तुम्ही जे आता फर्म लेव्हलला तुम्ही काय करता फर्म लेव्हलला व्हॉट काइंड ऑफ प्रॉब्लेम्स यू हॅव टू फेस रिलेटेड टू द प्रोडक्शन एटसेट्रा एटसेट्रा आता ठीक आहे प्रोडक्शन झालं यू हॅव प्रोड्यूस द प्रोडक्ट second level is nothing but in which market in which market you will sell your product so that your business performance can be improved i am getting the noise from somebody please uh, stop the mic okay second level is or the level of the market and the industry where yes at the first level this level what kind of problems the businesses has to be faced production price setting production cost. price setting cost profit etc that is at the which level firm level barobar second level is what the market level at the market level which kind of problems the businesses has to be solved or the face here i have mentioned the implication implication of the market structure means what company need to be focus on implication of the market structure means what akash सर म्हणजे बिझनेस परफॉर्मन्स आहे त्या आपल्या मार्केट स्ट्रक्चर काय इफेक्ट होईल त्याचा असं की कुठल्या मार्केट मध्ये आपण ते प्रोडक्ट सेल केल्यानंतर आपल्या कंपनीचं काय परफॉर्मन्स काय होईल इम्प्रूव्ह होईल इम्प्रूव्ह होईल अंडरस्टूड दॅट इज द इम्प्लिकेशन ऑफ द मार्केट स्ट्रक्चर फॉर द बिझनेस परफॉर्मन्स नंबर अँड साईज ऑफ द फर्म्स की तुमचा जर बिझनेस तुमच्या बिझनेसचे बिझनेस युनिट्स किती आहेत बिझनेस प्लॅन किती आहेत अंडरस्टूड that is the number and size of the firm firms and the limitation on the market expansion jar tumcha company che plants kiwa business units kami astil tar tumhi multiple market madhe tumcha product viku shakta ta there will be the limitation to access the market if your business plants are limited then can you able to access the all the kinds of market no sir no, no sir so if you are not, then that is the second problem my businesses might have to face that is related with number and the size of the firms ki tumcha company madhe kiti employee ahet tumcha company tumcha company che kiti plants ahet depends on that the company might have to face the limitation on the market expansion ki then how how much market you can capture with your product understood so these all the things related with the market capturing and uh, improving the business performance that is comes at the which level second level understood then we have the third level yes, sir. then we have the third level at which also the businesses may have to face the problems issue and for that they need to do the economic analysis the third level is what the national economy now at the level of national economy what kind of economic issue may be faced by the business 
and if they face the kind of issues they also need to do the economic analysis now at the national economy which kind of problems they have to deal with tax related sir exactly very good tip tax what is the tax structure then what is the interest rate why they have to think about the interest rate सर लोन घेतलं ते इंटरेस्ट रेट नुसार तुम्ही जर लोन घेतलं असेल तर तुम्हाला असं सगळ्याच बँकेचं इंटरेस्ट रेट सेम असू शकतो का नाही सर नाही डिफरंट बँक्स डिफरंट फायनान्सेस आर हॅविंग देयर डिफरंट इंटरेस्ट रेट मग जर एखाद्या देशाची इकॉनॉमी इफ सर्टन कंट्रीज इकॉनॉमी इज गोइंग डाऊन दॅट इज ऑल्सो द वन प्रॉब्लेम फॉर दॅट पर्टिक्युलर बिझनेस येस ऑर नो यस सर the same thing i have mentioned the economic issues facing business at this level of analysis are concerned with the problem of overall national economic performance jar overall deshachi economy jar kami hot asel then that is also the one particular uh, problem for that particular uh, business has to be consider okay and they have to also do the economic analysis related with that another things relate uh, which we can consider as a economic issue at the at the business for the different business these are nothing but the different level of interest rate they have to uh, uh, think on they have to do the analysis related with the rate of the economic growth they have to think on or they have to do the analysis related with the rate of taxation mag sagalyas deshancha rate of taxation same asto ka no sir no so they have to think about these kind of things etc okay level of interest rate rate of economic growth rate of taxation so they have then at the level of national economy they have to think about or they have to face the issues related with the overall economic performance of certain country that is the national economic performance and the last level that is the international economy now at this is the last level at which also certain businesses may have to face some issue and if the businesses face some issue then they can solve that kind of issue with the help of some economic analysis now at the international economy level what kind of issues the businesses might have to face sir uh, investment rates samjha dusra desh ki company ikad se bhi invest ke liye ka related problem hai आता इंटरनॅशनल इकॉनॉमी ही जी लेवल आहे ह्या लेवल वरती हिच काइंड ऑफ प्रॉब्लेम्स माइट बी कंपनी हॅज टू फेस सपोज दॅट कंपनी माइट हॅव टू माइट माइट हॅव टू व्हॉट यू कॅन से दॅट कंपनी माइट हॅव टू सेट अप देअर बिझनेस इन अनदर कंट्री येस ऑर नो इफ सम कंपनी वॉन्ट टू सेट अप देअर बिझनेस इन अनदर अनदर कंट्री that is the one economic issue they have to face at the international economy yes or no yes if the if the particular company has to set up their business in other country what kind of issues they have to think on what kind of analysis they they need to do at the international economy place money they need to think about the rate of exchange manje ka hai ki aplya desha madle aplya desha madhe konta he aaye which currency is there in our country rupees rupees mag tanla jar america madhe ekadya company la america madhe business aplya deshatli company aaye aplya deshatla company la kute business takaycha aaye america madhe mag america cha currency ka aaye dollar dollar मग ते डॉलर डॉलरच कन्वर्जन करावं लागेल की नाही त्याच्यासाठी सुद्धा काय येतो खर्च येतो सो इफ सर्टन कंपनी वॉन्ट टू सेट अप देअर बिझनेस इन अदर कंट्री दे हॅव टू फेस द प्रॉब्लेम्स लाईक प्रॉब्लेम्स रिलेटेड विथ द इंटरनॅशनल ट्रेड मग असं आहे का की गेलं आणि तिथं जाऊन बिझनेस सेट केला त्याच्यासाठी काही परमिशन वगैरे लागतात की नाही येस सर so the economic issues facing the business at the level of international economy at this level of analysis is concerned with the problems of the international trade okay problems of the international trade in the sense you have to take the permission of that country to set up the business then you have to 
think about the what will be the rate of exchange of dollar into the rupees rupees into the dollar etc etc then how will access their market access to the overseas market means what access to the overseas market overseas markets means what yes what do you mean by the overseas akash let's divide this word आउट ऑफ कंट्री ओवरसीज म्हणजे भारतावरती बरोबर ना जर आता या ह्या इंटरनॅशनल इकॉनॉमी मध्ये असं बी होऊ शकतं की तुमचा बिझनेस आपल्याच देशामध्ये पण तुम्हाला आपल्या देशामध्ये तुम्ही जे प्रोडक्ट प्रोड्यूस करता ते प्रोडक्ट कुठे विकायचे दुसऱ्या देशामध्ये बरोबर ना यस सर इन दॅट केस ऑल्सो द इकॉनॉमिक इश्यू हॅज टू बी फेस फॉर द बिझनेस लाईक हाऊ हाऊ यू विल सेल दॅट प्रोडक्ट इन टू द अनदर कंट्री now when you sell that product in the another country you money you will get in that in that in their currency tumhi jar america madhe product sell karta asal tar tumhala in which currency you will get the amount dollar dollar then how you will then how you will convert the that particular dollar into the rupees then how you will capture the overseas market how you will capture the market of for example if you take the example of america then what will be the implication of the overseas investment what do you mean by this implication of the overseas investment tikadcha marketing madhe investment karna jar tumhi tikade investment keli tar tyache parinam kay hotil changle hotil white hotil like this kind of things okay so these all the kind of economic issues has to be faced at the level of international economy barobar tyancha tikad cha rate of interest jar tumhi tikda business set karnar asel tar tumhala tithun you can take the loan from their that country banks of that country what will be the rate of interest of banks of that country what will be the tax structure of that country america cha tax structure ani aplya desha cha tax structure same hai ka no sir no so if you want to do the business in other country or if you want to sell the products of your business in other country that is that is means you are doing the international trade and when you are doing this international trade that comes under the category of the international economy and that is the reason at the level of international economy economic <laughs> issues various kind of various kind of economic issues which have to be faced are nothing but these like the international trade rate of exchange access to the overseas market implication of the overseas investment i forget to mention here the rate of interest of foreign countries then tax structure of the foreign countries these all the kind of issues you have to consider you have to do the economic analysis related with all these kind of issues at which level at the international level understood yes sir now tell me at the which is the first level that at which the business firm. might face the problems firm level at the firm level which kind of problems they need to face production production uh, yes. cost of production target uh, price and the profit etc etc what is the second level market and industry market what kind of problems they, they need to consider there at the level of market yes at the second level production limitation hmm. 
second level size of the firm size of the business unit then marketing trade मार्केटिंग ट्रेड की कुछ मार्केट मे प्रोडक्ट सेल के जेनेकर जाती जास्त प्रॉफिट हो थिंग्स प्रॉब्लम दे हैव टू कन्सिडर और इश्यू दे हैव टू सॉल्व एट द सेकंड लेवल थर्ड लेवल इज नथिंग बट व्हाट आवर नैशनल इकोनॉमी एट द नैशनल इकोनॉमी विच विच इश्यूज दे हैव टू कन्सिडर इंटरेस्ट रेट टैक्स रेट इंटरेस्ट रेट ऑफ कंट्री टैक्स रेट ऑफ कंट्री देन Overall, overall economy of the nation, overall economy of that uh, uh, what you can say country. These things are being uh, they have to think on uh, in case of the this third level and the last level. International, international economy. Economy. Which problems they have to consider there? Rate international trade rate of exchange. Permission related to the international trade, rate of exchange, then access access, access to, to the market. overseas market, how they can access the foreign market, rate of interest of that country, taxation structure of that country, etc. So these are the things. Okay, and that's it from the today's lecture. Next time we'll continue with the next part. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, thank you all of you. Thank you sir. Thank you sir.